Kentucky streetcar is up and running again this morning after a big overnight water main break. But there is a lot, and I mean a lot of damage to the streets near 10th and Walnut because of this. Let's go to 41 Action News reporter Ray Daniel. She's there. Ray, you've tweeted out some photos this morning of exactly what kind of damage we can see behind you. A hole in the road. How that bad is it there? Taylor, I mean, I'm just going to step out of the way so you all can see just the aftermath that this water main break did to this area. We're right on the corner of Walnut and 10th, and you can just see how big this hole is right now. And what's interesting is under this concrete, you can just see all these bricks, um, you know, that have probably been here for years and years. But, you know, this caution tape has just been put up. KC water crews are still on scene. Several crews have been here. Clearly, this area has been um, blocked off because of the sinkhole that we're seeing. It was impacting traffic, you know, with the amount of water that was flowing through. Water flowed from 10th to Main, hitting the streetcar tracks. Now, the streetcar was temporarily delayed until crews had all the debris cleared out of the way. There was a combo of mud, rock, and debris, and when it hardened, that it, it kind of, you know, it looked like concrete and it got stuck to the rails, preventing the streetcar wheels from moving smoothly inside the trackway. So that why that's why it was temporary de, temporarily delayed. But, you know, Casey Streetcar is back on opened at 6 a.m. and it went and it goes on. It'll be open until 2 a.m. So again, crews are taking care of this sinkhole. So you just want to avoid this area as much as possible. Live in Kansas City, Ray Daniel, 41 Action News today.